Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Swangile. Welcome to Life with Swo. Welcome to a new video. In today's video, I'm doing a what's in my handbag. This is a Vogue inspired what's in my handbag because I get we are channeling that energy. So the handbag I'm using is a Michael Kors handbag. This was a birthday gift and this is actually a very special gift because the person who gifted me this told me that since I'm a content creator, she wanted to give me a bag that's going to fit my cameras and everything that I need to create so I thought this was such a thoughtful gift I love it so much I'm usually somebody who likes to put her things away for special occasions but I am actually wearing my bag more often now my favorite thing now is to edit in coffee shops or libraries so I take my bag with to be the boss babe that I am and I fill it up and I go to my coffee shop and I work from there so let's see what's in my handbag so first thing in my handbag is my laptop so I take my laptop with me to edit my videos and I enjoy editing from coffee shops because I feel like I'm more productive and since I don't know anybody there I'm not distracted easily and I am actually able to edit quicker and more efficiently and I am able to focus more on the task at hand Another thing that's in my handbag is my diary. Love my diary. This is my 2024 planner and it's got a cute little pen attached to it. I love this diary because I feel like it's so detailed and I used to work for a production company that produces shows for Zanzi Magic and I feel like I like to be organized in my everyday life as I forget easily ever since becoming a mom I actually forget things easily so it's more important for me to write things down especially when I've got an idea for YouTube or things that I need to do sometime in the week for the kids so I like to jot it down so that I can remember and it's also very cute it's nice and pink so it makes the activity fun as well something else I got I've got another notebook in my bag I like to write down my um, content ideas on this notebook and I've had this book since 2021 actually and sometimes when I don't know what to shoot I will go back to um, the content that I had planned to shoot back then which I didn't get to shoot and it's still it's still like a juicy piece of content idea in my opinion Wow guys I wrote a whole lot of things you would not believe like I had such amazing plans for my videos and I love that I would write everything step by step especially for the weekly vlogs that I used to shoot I would write down on Monday what am I gonna do Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday how I'm editing this vlog and whatnot so I love having a notebook because it makes me feel super organized the thing I've got is my airpods cannot go anywhere without these I need them one for editing or when I'm on my way to a destination or location then I like to pop my airpods on and listen to my favorite music oh I also have a tripod for my camera a mini tripod and I can just pop this on the table while I'm editing and then I can capture that as a b-roll and I, I like this cute little tripod because it's, it doesn't feel invasive hey it doesn't feel like I've got a ginormous tripod in people's faces this is perfect and it fits nicely into my bag Ooh. got my cell phone can't go anywhere without it oh, got a hairbrush because this hair that's not really ours can disappoint you sometimes so you cannot be caught slipping girl got pocket tissue because I'm a girl with allergies and yeah got this ritual hand lotion I love this hand lotion so much it's an instant care hand lotion and it smells so good this was a gift from my husband from one of his trips so it's one of those lotions that I want to keep in my bag as like a special lotion I've got my cell phone charger can't go anywhere without it so I use this to charge my cell phone and my airpods got a mini travel mascara you never know when you're gonna need to touch up on your makeup then I've got of course a Fenty Beauty gloss balm my favorite 
And then, ooh, a Fenty Skin Plush Pudding. Like, how many lip care stuff does a girl need? Huh? Got hair ties. You just never know if you're gonna need it. It's just one of those just-in-case things. And then I've got a Love Explosion perfume from Zara. This is actually one of my favorite. Of course, hand sanitizer. Oh, and then I've got another lippy stuff. This is a overnight lip mask. It's a strawberry overnight lip mask. I think this might be a Laneige dupe. Um, it feels really good on the lips and I cannot believe that I bought this only for two euros. Oh, and then I've got some eye drops because I wear contact lenses and after a couple of hours my eyes feel really dry so this gives me instant relief and it is perfect. Uh -huh. Then I also have my shades. I change my shades depending on what outfit I'm wearing and today since I'm wearing a cream white jersey of course I've got my white shades. How cool are these? <laughs> then I have a Zara Freshnably London perfume. Oh, this smells so good. This is really good. And then I have another lip mask. I got this from I got this from Primark, but it sort of reminds me of the topical lip balm is it a lip balm or lip gloss this is quite nice actually it's a really thick oh and then i've got a lipstick and lip liner duo i love this combo i feel like lip liners should come like this now a lip liner should come with a lipstick as a combo i usually have my wallet and my camera in my bag but my camera is right here working putting in the hours and my wallet is somewhere in my smaller bag but i don't usually carry my wallet because my card is usually on my phone so that's yeah anyway i hope that you guys enjoyed this cute little video let me know if this is your vibe and if you enjoyed this video make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll catch you guys on the next one until then keep